here in Whistler, Whistler along with my friend Sarah and um, we are staying in Crystal Lodge Hotel which I'm gonna show you around so let's go guys so the room is super tiny and when, when we saw it online it was actually super big and a surprise that when we enter here it's not very big so let me tour you around first this is the um, as you enter the door you will see this tiny closet where you can hang your jacket and also they have a tiny it's they have a closet here where you can hang your clothes they have an extra blanket they have a, a kettle I think that's uh, an ice container and there's an iron there and there's two robes here and a place where you can put your luggage and two a couple of slippers and this is my friend's jacket she already hanged it and then an iron board right here and then right behind me it's where you will find the bathroom which it's an okay size it's not very big and this is their bathroom it's actually nice and this is their toilet and this is extra towels and this is their sink just Oh, a hair dryer, more towels, and here I am. Hello. And right outside the bathroom, you will see two beds one for me, one for Sarah. Hi, Sarah. Hey. Um, so that's where she's gonna stay and this is where I'm gonna stay actually the place is not bad it's actually it's a decent size I guess if you're not very picky and this is the um, they have an ex they have a mirror over here where you can pretty up yourself and watch yourself if you're vain <laughs> they have a lamp and they have a TV and they have drawers here three drawers one two three and they have a tiny fridge inside and there's a lot of boo oh there's wine oh my god as Sarah said we're gonna be in trouble tonight <laughs> and then more drinks over there and they have a complimentary coffee right here and oh more travel for us more wine and I guess if you want to do your laundry it, it comes with the soap here and I don't know what this is I think it's some sort of water bottle, water bottle. and then oh a snack and more snack and then there's more mirror here and another lamp and I guess this is where you see it when you're doing your computer and oh they have a garbage place here 
and they have um, a heater slash AC and this is our window and this is our window and our view our outside oh look at that oh my god look at the outside it has a view of the mountains and other and our neighbor over there so yeah and the two bed two two double bed oh she's drinking are you drinking wine cheers is I that wine or water this is straight vodka no it's just water ah. <laughs> <laughs> so you're pretending just water yeah so there's a lamp here and then uh Tele telephone, a clock, and something to write on, and then here, what's in here? What is this? Oh, an air, air plug. Okay. And then there's a safe here. Alrighty. Okay, so <laughs> what do we think about this hotel? So me, far? me, I think... I think so far, as soon as we walk into the lobby, she went to the front desk to check in. And then she told me that the parking is how much? $24? $24, $25. $25 yeah. per, per night, which is yeah. kind of insane because I've never, I've never really been to a hotel where they charge you for parking. Extra. Extra, yeah. extra parking. So yeah, this is so. like the first time ever. But maybe they're just taking advantage of the fact that it's Whistler. So it's kind of like really popular place for in BC. And then, so yeah, the picture online, it's so big. But when you get into the hotel, it's very small. But it's, <laughs> it's clean. Other than that, it's so clean. And I like it. And another thing that I can say is the air plugs it kind of like questioned me a little bit. Why is there, why there are air plugs? Mm -hmm. Maybe it's noisy. Maybe there's people that, you know, come You'll... with people that uh, snore. <laughs> like me? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not, you know, I'm not going to mention any names of Riz, but... <laughs> that would be me. You have to, you need this tonight. <laughs> so, so yeah. Um. So what about you, Sarah? What can you say about this place so far? We've only been here for like 10 minutes. Yeah, I think so far you're right about the size. It did look a lot bigger in the picture, but... Mm -hmm. I feel like this is a, a good size for me. Like, for me personally, I don't think it's an issue. Um, I think it is bullshit that I don't know if I could say that on your channel. But <laughs> it's okay. You can say whatever you want. <laughs> that we have to pay an extra $24 yeah, or yeah. 25 bucks to and park a car. Um, yeah, so just be careful because it comes with what I thought it was complimentary wine, but you might have to. Whatever you use, you have to pay for it. Yeah, I think that because she was like, oh my god, there's wine. We're going to be in trouble. I was like, no, you might want to check to see if like this place, yeah. is uh, the wine is actually free. Comes but you it. might, it might, they might charge you. And so, yeah, yeah other but than that. I would say that the view is cute. Mm -hmm. it's, it's pretty nice. Mm -hmm. um, you can see a little bit of the mountain. Um, the room is very clean. And it's a good size bed for one yeah. person as oh, well. Oh, yeah. So. Even if you have another extra person, a couple, but it might be too cramped if mm -hmm. you have another additional person, right? Yeah. And so when it comes to this hotel, I think this is sponsored by Sarah. Thank oh. you, Sarah. Mm -hmm. And I want to know how much you paid for this place. Uh, 115? 115? Mm -hmm. 15. Yeah, oh, okay. 115. So it's 115. I guess it's okay if you pay the extra um parking i guess because some places they charge you like almost 200 right yeah so yeah it's it's fine but anyway we are gonna cheers oh where's your drink it's okay cheers sarah <laughs> although we are not an alcoholic people so we're just <laughs> we're just gonna speak have, for yourself we're just gonna have yeah. the wine i mean the water water because we're not sure if we're gonna get charged for the wine yeah. otherwise we're gonna be drinking it maybe later yeah. <laughs> you okay. never know. All right, we'll see you later, guys, and we'll show you around and and tell you what are what else are the pros and cons about this place. So that way you will have an idea how you know when you come here. And so yes, we'll see you later. <laughs>
for you to come here, you have to make a res reservation um, in advance. And I think they only allow 10 people to um, to stay in, in the pool. Otherwise, you have to stay for an hour and then then they will clean it after for the next people and this pool is closed at 10 o'clock. So it's really nice and, and hot. I think they allow 10 people.